you're doing fantastic. I am doing great myself. Welcome in. We're going to be playing some Cyberpunk today. The plan was to play Final Fantasy 13. There was some issues with it getting ported, I think. And so I was having some troubles getting it launched. Um, so we're doing a pivot, which is fine. We'll get, we'll get to Final Fantasy 13 eventually. I think there's a workaround for it that we can do, but, uh, yeah. With that being said, it's all right. You know, we'll get to it eventually. Cyberpunk's another game that I've always like wanted to get through. Um, we played maybe like six hours or so on stream. I think it was like two days. And then we were playing something else and we just got we got sucked into another game, I think. And we never came back to it. So we're just going to start a fresh game since uh, we didn't get really get too far. So this is going to be a first playthrough. Uh, I've only seen the very beginning pretty much. Game was fun. But uh, yeah. So let's hop over. I'm excited for the game. It's it's it was sweet and it looked awesome, and the play was really fun. I just got sucked into another game, so it'll be cool to get back to it. Plus, we have the DLC to play, so obviously that's going to be at the end. But uh, yeah, without further ado, boom. So yeah, I think it was like seven hours. It was like two two days that we played something like that. So we're just gonna we're gonna start fresh. Regular start. And we're going to play on hard. Um, oops. I think... Um, I think hard is a good difficulty. That way we, we, get, we get some struggles here and there, but we're not just getting absolutely blasted away playing very hard, especially for the first time. So I think that's the choice. I feel like that's what I play on most games. I don't go to the crazy deep end unless I've played the game multiple times. Hard is fine to start with. Um. So we can choose from three different life paths to start with. Some events and dialogue options in the game will be different depending on your choice. Okay. Nomad. Roaming the Badlands, looting scrapyards, raise. Raiding fuel depots. Life on the road wasn't easy, but growing up in a nomad clan has its perks. Honestly, integrity and love of freedom. Qualities that few in the night city possess and no amount of money can buy. Street kid. They say if you want to understand the streets, you gotta live them gangs. Fixers, dolls, small time pushers. You were raised by them all. Down here, the law of the jungle dictates the weak. Serve the strong. The only law in Night City you have yet to break. Okay. Okay, so we can be like part of the gangs. That one sounds pretty good. Corpo. You leave the corporate world with their lives fewer still with their souls intact. You've been there. You've bent the rules, exploited secrets, and weaponized information. There's no such thing as a fair game. Only winners and losers. I think Street Kid sounded the best. I think that's what we did last time, but we didn't get too far, so that, that might be the choice. All of them are cool, but I think we're going to do Street Kid. Um, just for viewer no like discretion, I guess. I did turn nudity off. Just because it doesn't really matter to me, so... Oh man, we gotta do character creation. This could take a while. This could be the entire night. What is that? Oh, is that randomized? Oh my god. Those are some wild, randomized... Holy moly. I think we're gonna start with this one and then uh, and uh, work work our way around. That one looks kind of normal, kind of normal. I'm V. Like uh, 
as in like kind of like me. Well, I'm pretty pale, so. We just, here we go. I was like, is there a thing that I could just, yeah. I think that one's going to do it. That's pretty pale. In type. Hmm. Yeah, I guess maybe one with a little bit of freckles. Just a little bit, though. I don't have a ton of freckles on my face. We're going for close to us. I don't think any of these. That one? Oh, no. Yeah, I think we're just going to go with like a... That one's pretty standard looking. Oh man, bald. That's something. It's kind of cool looking. Where's the... Um... Oh, there we go. Yeah, we have we have that. We have longer than that though, but it's fine. That's pretty good. The top knot. Oh, this one. It's like wavy. I don't know. There's so many hairstyles. They're all so crazy, too. Freaking wild. Uh, okay. We're back to the beginning. I think we're gonna do just the top knot. Yeah? I think that's good. Air color? Oh, you know we gotta be red. Is that too red? That looks like orange. I think that's gonna be it. Damn. That's like super red. Well, this is okay. It's like brown into red. Oh, that's kinda cool. It's like black on the bottom, red on top. Oh, it's more pink. I think we're gonna, let's do this. It's like that black and then dark red. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. I like it. Oh god. Okay. Keep hitting that. You like it too, baby? That's what I think. It looks pretty good. And then eyes. Oh, man. It's kind of weird. It's bugging me out. Those ones look kind of normal. He looks like he's a little... A little toasty. Those ones look okay. 15. Maybe it's just the face doesn't look right. We'll have to mess with the face. I think 15 was our, is a good one. Those ones look okay too. Just one.
eye color. Oh man, should we have red eyes? That's kind of cool. <laughs> I forget, you can just do crazy stuff because you're just like all cybernetic. That's so cool. That's freaking wild. I like the red though. Eyebrows. Those look okay. Eyebrow color. <laughs> uh, we're just gonna go with the same as the hair. That's fine. <clears throat> Can we get oh eyelashes? Eh, we're not gonna miss the eyelashes. Those look fine. If I mess with them too much, they're going to start looking weird. We're trying not to look too crazy. We're going to have a little bit, a little bit of crazy, but not too crazy. That's a big honking nose. That one's okay. That's probably... Pretty normal. Standard nose. Kind of like mine. I guess I don't... I keep saying standard, but when I say standard, I'm just comparing it to my nose. I didn't have a problem with this one, bef with this before. Seems like it's it's pausing a little bit. I like that mouth. It's pretty good. Jaw three looked okay. Jaw eight's okay. It's a little small though. Twelve is okay. I think I, I think that looks good. That looks good. Oh, those are those elf ears. Man, an elf? Kind of looks like me when I was a kid. I had big old pointy ears. Uh, those are fine. Here we go. Now, now we're in it. The beard. Uh, that one's okay. Six. That's a big beard. That one's not bad either. Nine. I think we're going to go with nine. Boom. Beard color. Change it up. I like it. Face tattoos. Cyberware. Oh, nice. We can change up our stuff here. I don't really like it when it goes across the nose. Ooh, that looks weird. This one looks okay. The eyes. I also don't mind the first one. I think that one looks pretty good. the neck. That's pretty good, too. I think we're just going to stick with that. <clears throat> I think that looks good. 
Piercings? Ooh. I do have a piercing. I got one piercing. I don't know if that's an option. Oh, it is an option. It's the wrong ear, though. Dang it. There we go. A little bit of gold. Nice. I don't think they'll give me the... Uh... I don't think they'll give me a one dagger in my ear. I don't think it's going to happen. okay though teeth oh god do we need some big old metal teeth <laughs> kind of scary eye makeup yeah we don't need makeup we don't need makeup my nails Oh, you can just take your nipples off, apparently. You know? I guess you you don't need them. It's kind of funny. There was a body tattoo that I actually did like. I think. That one, was it? I think it, yeah, I think it was. Unless it was this one. I think it was this one. I like the light blue. Pretty cool. Scars? Whoa. It's kind of wild. Next! Oh, this is points. Okay, we're out of uh, character creation now. Okay. Well, like, making how he looks. I think it looks pretty good. He doesn't look like a crazy cyberpunk character, but, uh, you know. I think it looks good. So, we gotta look at these. Because this is gonna matter for what we go into. Strength. Or body, not strength. Yeah, pretty much the same thing. Each attribute contains a set of skills. Both attributes and skills provide different bonuses depending on your style of play. Skill levels increase as you perform activities associated with them. The maximum level of a skill is limited by the level of the attribute that it belongs to. Okay. Body determines your raw physical power and fortitude. Progressing it improves your proficiency with shotguns, light machine guns, blunt weapons. It also enables you to open some doors by force, rip off turrets, and use intimidating and solo trained dialogue choices. Plus two health per attribute. I kind of like that. That sounds awesome. Shotguns? I kind of like shotguns. Um... Intelligence. Determining your net running abilities. Progressing it provides or improves your proficiency with smart weapons and allows you to unleash your full potential as a net runner. It also enables you to access local subnets and show off your knowledge of the net in dialogues. Plus one max RAM per four attribute points. Reflexes. Determine your maneuverability and ability to evade enemy attacks. Progressing the attribute improves your proficiency with assault rifles, submachine guns, and blades. It enables you to use advanced movements. It also enables you to make quick, observant remarks and dialogues. I kind of like that. Assault rifles are going to be sick. I think that's going to be what we go down, but we'll see. 
Technical ability determines your techie know-how. Progressing it improves your proficiency with explosives and tech weapons and allows you to become be compatible with high-end cyberware. It also allows you to bypass some locks, override devices, and exhibit tech-savvy knowledge and dialogues. Plus two armor per attribute point. That one seems pretty good, too. Hmm. Cool. Oh, we're cool. We're freaking cool. I saw we just dump all of our points into that. All of them. Each attribute contains a set of skills. Oh, yeah, what what does cool do? I already read that. Cool determines your assassination skills and stealth abilities. Uh, this is the stealth one. Progressing it improves your proficiency with precision rifles, sniper rifles, handguns, throwable weapons. It also enables you to advance stealthy perk abilities and subtle or street smart dialogue choices. Hmm. I think I think intelligence, reflexes, and tech is gonna be good. And uh maybe somebody just to get health. We have seven points to put in. I think we're gonna go reflexes. Assault rifles sound good. They sound pretty good. So we're gonna go five, one body. Um, actually, let's go six reflexes, one intelligence, two tech, or one. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's go that. Right. Is intelligence? Oh, smart weapons. Maybe we don't want to do intelligence then. Maybe we want to just dump into tech. Hmm. Because this seems good because you can bypass locks. I guess this lets you get into locals. I don't know. Let's just do that. Cool. Cool. We'll figure out if that's bad later on. I don't know. We'll we'll see what we end up needing to dump points into. I guess as we play. And if not, then uh, I guess we're just going to lose. Over and over and over. That's it. That's me. Let's get this game started. Let's drink that shot first. That's a rough way to start. Rough way to start. Okay. Said that broken nose. Ooh. Oh, motherfucker. Everything chill, mano? Some bastard tried to mug me. I handled it. Oh, local guy. You really think somebody local will try to mug me, Pepe? Yikes. Listen, V. I got a problem. Serious this time. Find yourself a hole, sounds like. You need help. Ah, knew I could count on you. It's a uh, cork. I owe him. Don't pay by tomorrow, said he bust my legs. He don't joke about that stuff. Got cartels in his corner. You in it with Kirk? Every man, woman, and rat in Haywood knows he's a fucking shark. My bro jumped the joint. Deserve the hero's welcome. I know I fuck up, V.
I'll talk to Kirk. But then you're gonna owe me one. Bam. All right. Welcome to Cyberpunk. First time in Night City. Pay close attention to tutorials. Learn more about basic mechanics of the game. Or if you've already experienced Edrunner, feel free to disable hints. Go to the database at any time during the game to access tutorials, as well as read up on most important topics. Okay. Okay. You're saving my life, v. Truly. Demons walk with him. They tear at his soul. But I'll tell him you're sorry. This game is crazy. Checking exactly. It was two bottles of sense on short last time. No, no, that ain't possible. Oh, I was at the hospital today. Javi's got some broken ribs, but praise Jesus, the bullet didn't hit any organs. What happened? A police manhunt. They were chasing some dealers. So he had it coming, eh? He was just standing there. Standing, understand? Me. NCPD peaks were shooting everyone. He don't deal, never has. Having brown skin. Drama, drama. I'm guessing this is Kirk. Hey, Kirk. Wanna talk? V, been a while? Spin it, what you need? Pepe asked me to talk you up. What, he too shot a hand over the Yetis himself? Uh, tell him I don't bite. Not yet. How's your problem? <laughs> Cut him some slack, will you? He'll pay. Just need some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No, you let him off because it's me asking. Huh, <laughs> you know me. I'm a man of the biz. So I need to know what I get out of it. Uh, I'll owe you one or you'll avoid trouble? I think... Hmm. Transactions go two ways. I get that. I'll owe you a favor. Tempting. Got a Nova idea already. What's this? Grab a look. It's a nice looking car. I mean, <laughs> mm hmm. Cream ride there on the page. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Two, Mayor Ryan. Three, a rental service. Oh, oh God damn. And four. Number four will belong to my client. Thank you for the hydrate. As soon as you clep it for me, that is. Not sure I can pull it off. I do this and the debt's paid. I do this and Pepe's debt is squared. Of course. I'm a man of my word. You know that. Sure. Whole thing simple. Sure. You swipe the Rayfield for me, I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. My man Rick works a parking structure by Embers, club where our Rayfield driver likes to kick it. There every Friday night, like clockwork. Soon as you appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up, the road is yours. Just gotta grab the Rayfield and roll out. Simple. Yeah, let's get some info on this. Who owns this ride? Who's the owner? Just an Arasaka suit from across the water. Spews cash out of every hole in his body. And his name? How would I know? Why would I care? It's a hot item and I know where to find it. <laughs> Honestly, shit plan. Plan sounds shaky as fuck. Oh, how so? Sounds like you're looking for a sucker. This ain't no setup, V. Heard you got a good head. Maybe we help each other make a few eddies. And your man Rick? And your man Rick? Trust him like my own brother. 
Car security how to get around. How am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Fast and easy? Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. This bitty bop works like the key Rayfield techs use for repairs. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. <laughs> Come on, Kirk, even you don't buy that. Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. Have a little faith. That seems a little... So, a little sketchy. Then. A little sketchy. Best keep your word, Kirk. Easy, V. Job's gonna pad your wallet too, you know? Head to Ember's in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. You two will hit it off. Good luck out there. We'll be in touch. All right, well, shit. Let's go. Perales has my vote. Man, it don't matter. Perales, Ryan, Malone, getting a bell right now. Bullshit. Come on, he's best in his way. Roach race. Nice. It's Roach. It's Roach. Oh, wait, we can play this? No, we gotta be Roach. Yeah. Up, down. F. That's it. That's all we got. Up, down, F. Go, Roach. What the hell? The button's changed. Alright, we got this. I, b I believe. Jesus. <laughs> Yo, go, Roach. What was that? <laughs> Go, Roach! <laughs> I didn't know this horse was so ten- Oh, no! Well... I don't think I'm gonna beat that high score. Otherwise, we'll be sitting here for a while. Alright. That was kind of cool, though. TDP Arcades, thanks for playing Roach. What a, what a fun little Easter egg. Damn, I'm poor. I don't even have a dollar. <sighs> Fat ass motherfucker. Hey, why do I see no goddamn lemons? No goddamn limes? They're in there, for sure. Oh damn, they, they got shipment. Spare a veteran some change. Look at that ray, the ray tracing. I forgot that I actually had that turned on. Cybernetic God comes to the door to the children. people in Santo. Tell them to be ready. Yes, Padre. Well, who do we have here? Uh, we? Long time. Didn't know you were around. Haywood hasn't changed a bit. Yep. No place like home. Sebastian Ibarra, I haven't changed a smidge. No one calls me by my name anymore. Almost forgotten how it sounds. How are things, Padre? The same. Haywood. Nothing ever changes here. I'd rather hear about you. Got back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. See you got a good down-home welcome. How was it back east? 
Tell you later. Got something on my plate. How about you fill me in now? We'll give you a ride. Marcus, let's go. All right. Padre's our guy. So where to? The Glen. Drop me off at Embers. Front door? Take the ramp back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard it, Marcus. This game is really pretty. Your return to NC has been good. Busy already? And two years gone by, not much has changed. You know how it would. It has strong roots, ever watered by the same blood. Now, tell me about you. Eh, I pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So... Atlanta didn't turn out like you expected, huh? As you can see, I'm back. If I'd been better there, wouldn't have left. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. Uh oh shit stop the car what's going on business you carry mm, I don't have anything on me hell no give me give me a gun Sebastian Ibarra looks like it's my lucky day what do you want? To settle our biz once and for all. Got an offer for you, Patty, so listen up. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen. Done deal. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be. Who is this guy? Well, Patty. One more fucking word. Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you. Which means you're worth shit around here and capable of even less. Well, Damn. anything else? It seems our conversation has come to a close. Careful, Padre. Never know who's got a barrel at your six. You neither, shit bucket. Marcus, please. No, V's. V doesn't give a damn. Don't give no sh I am pleased to see you have not forgotten your roots. All right. I still have the gift. So many of the little shits left around here. Their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. Who was that? No one important. He'll be gone in a week's time. Another will come in his place. He pulled iron on you. He did. And he will pay for doing so. Damn. I like. Pull up here. I like the way the right story's here. going so far. I'll just drop down below. Here, before you go. Your number could be useful. Maybe we can also work together again. Take ourselves back two years. Thanks, Padre. Gotta go. So Damn. go with God. That was a cool, cool intro. Whoa, okay. All right, we'll just uh, jump off a bridge. That's cool. One way to get where you gotta go. Oh, we can run now. I don't think we have a gun yet though. Corpo thieves must die. Game is nuts. Just so much. B? Status. On location. About to find your man. 
Rick's one of the good guys, you'll see. I trust him like a brother. Yeah, so you said. Yo, is that loot? Oh no. We're already getting into the point where we're a loot goblin. Oh damn. Look at all these cars. Yeah. Something I can help you with. You Rick? You Rick? Yep. You with Kirk? Yep. Cameras are blind. You got 20 minutes. Alright. Find the Rayfield. I see the ride. Your moment hey. to shine, Joe. Good luck. That's a snazzy car. Wasn't even the one we were looking for, but that's that's nice looking too. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. All right. Yeah, we'll actually do our mission now. We'll stop looking at cars. Take this piece of wonder tech for a world. <laughs> You're a man of little faith. See? We're rich. Now fire her up and call me when you're underway. I'll tell you where to go. Hmm. Looks like this will be a cool breeze. All right. Cool breeze. Uh. <laughs> oh, it was a setup. It was a setup. You're under arrest. Stay where you are. Hands where I can see him. Nice and slow. On the ground, motherfuckers, now. Jackie Wells, my old pal from the hood. See you haven't grown an ounce white. Hey! Detective Stinks! Been a while, huh? Inspector Stinks. Inspector! <laughs> Same shit. Speaking of, your mug's familiar too. Come on, spit it out. How about that? Pig that chatters. <laughs> Left for Atlanta. Looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the same for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Looks like I was right. Rat got your tongue? No. Fuck all about me. Truth hurts, huh? I Just think we're gonna be a hard ass. Home. I'm not a patient man. Come on, Stint. Give us a break, huh? You lock us up, let just jerk off till trial. And then what? Worst case, we get some months. Hell, standing room only nowadays in El Bote. So, they'll probably be out early. Are these the thieves? Oh, dear. street trash. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be taking oh, him shit. down. Oh, shit. It's a waste of effort. This is the guy that owns it? I have no it? time to testify or play it on an investigation. Suggesting we let him go, sir? I suggest you toss them in the sea. Cuff legs broken so this trash doesn't flow. Yeah. You heard him. <sighs> Fuck. Corrupt as hell. Honestly, for a sec there, things looked iffy. Wasn't sure we'd worm out of that alive. Nah, Stintz wouldn't do us like that. You sure about that? Mm-hmm. He's Hayward born, bred, and grown like us. Hates suits as much as you do. Did what he had to do. That's it. 
I hadn't come, you'd be cruising Night City in sexy wheels right now. <laughs> nah, come on. Job was toxic from the start. Even Kabuki under the counter magic can't get around an alarm like that. Should have known I'd have the PD on my ass. So, maybe now, as God ordained, Jackie Wells. V. I know you. You hang at the Coyote. Got the job to steal those wheels at the Coyote. From Kirk. You work with that sewer slug? Pepe wasn't big and can't afford to pay, so I stepped up. Man, gotta wonder about Pepe letting slimy Kirk boss him around like that. Heard what they say. He's backed by cartels. Cartels? No, no, listen. I know those cartel types, and I guarantee you, none of them have even heard of Kirk. El cabron's gotta learn. He don't do people in Haywood dirty. Come on. Let's go have some lunch. Poor buddies all of a sudden. Just like that? You put a barrel to my skull not uh, so best, long best ago. Best buds. Best friends. You know my homies. You're okay in my book. No harm, no foul. None at all. Getting one of my good feelings. <laughs> About what? <laughs> About us. Sense of kind of chemistry, you know? Come on. I'm fucking starved. Okay. Food it is. Let's go. Game looks so damn good. Hello there, Night City! Stanley here with you, and we got another day ahead of us in this city of dreams. Ooh, I love this town. Not like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals, but only half these gobs will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one. And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Blackhand, and Waylon Boa Boa. The greater the risk, the bigger the party gets. Or so they say, but you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you live, the faster you burn out. Legends, know where you'll find most of them? The graveyard. <laughs> matters not where you're from, matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City, the city of dreams. I think we're looking for her somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Uh, I feel like we should do this. Militech? Jack, we're talking classified military great shit here. How'd you get it? T-Bug. And our girl made a couple adjustments. Why? Think she knows better? Nah. Said it didn't suit her, uh, style. <laughs> You'll see what I mean. Sure. Why the hell not? Might as well learn how to actually play the game. I mean, I guess we could go in guns a blazing, but let's begin with basic combat training. This session will be recorded for subsequent evaluation. This course is designed to reinforce your fundamental combat abilities and hone your reflexes. The skills you gain here will help you survive even excel on the battlefield. I will train you to be effective with firearms, to use stealth tactics to your advantage, and to hack into enemy networks. All right. Because at Militech, 
Man, Whoa. Militech can't encrypt for shit. <laughs> but they clearly got drilling jarheads in their blood. Now, station one, you maggot. Move, move, move. Hope you're ready to bust. Let's blast through a tactical target practice program. You know, a little warm up. I have a gun. Oh. Nice. Yeah, I didn't think you'd find that too tough. It what feels do you good. Say we crank it up a notch. The shooting feels good. Shooting range weapons drain stamina. Okay. But it's more realistic if the target's packing iron. Quit standing around and take cover. Press left control to hide behind cover. Okay. You took a hit. Use a reanimator to patch yourself up. X is heal. Okay. That feels kind of weird. X. I will get used to it. I guess. Training area when you're good to go. Oh look, brought some tombs with him this time. You know what to do, V. Do I know what to do? Oh, you can weave. You can weave around corners. That's kind of nice. That's kind of sick. Hacking's the next item on the menu. Might notice I tweaked the course material a bit. All right. Might as well see how to do this. Dangerous highlighted in red. Devices that can be hacked are marked in green. Interactive objects are highlighted in blue. This training module will teach you how to apply tech. Work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. over substance that's kind of cool then you just Good. now take him out quietly then you can sneak up on him filth was all never right. all yours my strong take suit never smart to leave behind any trace of your handiwork especially the dead kind now pick up the body and hide it somewhere Throw it in a dumpster. Classic. <laughs> so okay. aggressive. Now try to take him down in one slick move. That was that was kind of cool. You think you're ready to try hacking some gonks in real time? Have fun. Now, detonate the grenade. Oh, damn, you can blow up their grenades? Bang! It's <laughs> kind of sick. Certain devices like computer terminals, network access points, etc. can be hacked. Directly using special interface called the breach protocol. Doing so can unlock new information, benefits, and resources. Approach the access point and press F. Hi, Vivi. Okay. Oh, this is like, uh, hacking. Okay. 55, 55. 
If reached the network, you must recreate its code sequence by selecting characters from the code matrix. The characters you select will be visible in the buffer. That's not that hard hacking. Probably gets more difficult. Program is now successfully uploaded to the network. If you don't succeed, try again. After a time, there's no penalties for failing. Kind of like uh, funnel out hacking. See, just needed to shut your brain down and follow orders in true Militech fashion. Under my quick wise hacks. command, you're a real champ. Outside of this training, Take your spot on the podium. You must have a cyber deck with quick hacks installed on it. Okay. Not too shabby. Militech's algorithms put you on a decent run. Got Hacking. additional modules if you want to hone any other skills. Or you finish up, Delta out now. But remember, the street's not going to give you any hints or second chances. Okay, so this is... You've completed a mandatory portion of the tutorial. Feel free to interact with the door to exit the simulation. Yeah, if you wish to learn right. other gameplay features, I think... I think we're fine. I don't think we need to do that. I mean, we can finish these two, but... Eh, should we just do it? Might as well. Whatever. Let's blast through a tactical target practice program. You Can know, we do this already? Yeah, I didn't think you'd find that too tough. I thought we did this. What do you say we crank it up a notch? Not bad. But it's more realistic if the target's packing iron. Quit standing around and take cover. Yeah, we did this already. You took a hit. Use a reanimator to patch yourself up. Head to the training area when you're good to go. Oh, oh and we can slide. Some chooms with him this time. You know what to do, be. Nice. I guess it's kind of nice to get used to the combat, but we'll get used to it as we play. Stand on the platform and we'll move on. Got additional modules if you want to okay. hone any other skills. Yeah, we're done. Before you finish up, Delta out now. Bad, huh? Cool. Now we can get down to biz. Thanks for giving you any tips. Will Kako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Sha. Let's do this. Time to work. Elevator. This way. Cool. Equipping combat gadgets. Assign a grenade to your combat gadget quick slot in your inventory so you can make easy use of it. <clears throat> so it's set to... Your movie. This is what we're wearing? We're just rocking a t-shirt? You think they? we could have been smarter about this? Maybe a little bit? We have a pistol, that's all we got. Okay. Oh, and this is your quick access, so you have gr grenades in your healing. Cool. Subject. Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. 
Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. Oh, damn. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Damn. Charming. Excellent. I look better. It's hard to get my, my like, brightness and stuff. Good for nighttime. We'll have it set up better once we get to the new place. And get all our, our room all, all good and set. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her biomop. Fingers crossed it's not too late. Is that you? Oh, I hate this life or death shit. Her, try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? Maybe. We did it. Okay. Hostile area. We have quick save. V. Having to have highlights objects. Uh. Like uh, the Witcher. I got gotcha. you. Yeah, 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 we're going, we're going. Chill out, my guy. Are we fucking late? Is that her? Is that our target, V? Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo Immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix-ups. Not our lucky gal. What's this? Let's keep looking. Emergency on to band? How did it happen? When and why did we as a society decide that human life is a commodity, a luxury? My mother passed away at 45. She still has decades of life to live until it was all stolen from her by common pneumonia. If she had held even the cheapest trauma team policy, she could have been cured within an hour. But she couldn't afford it. My mother died five months before her scheduled appointment with our family practitioner. Five months? <clears throat> the idea of privatized healthcare is deeply ingrained in our public psyche already in 2020. There was widespread consensus that 500 euro dollars a month was a fair price for trauma team insurance. Damn. That uh hits a little too close to home. Yeah, well, I don't think there's anything else. Nina, eyes up. Then the hell's ahead. Drop it quietly. Oh, okay. Careful now. Done and done. Anything else in here? Just that thing to read? Oh no, here we go. Force have some bloody bandage medical gods. What do those do? I don't know. What's this say? Cyberware usage and its side effects. Many people believe we live in a time when impossible has become an obsolete term. Ripper docs can replace nearly any part of the human body with artificial implants from your big toe to portions of your nervous system. My years in trauma team, however, taught me that, that the impossible is still very much possible. Even now, as we enter the twilight of the 21st century, we as medical professionals have not been able to eliminate all the side effects that come from incorporating cybernetic elements into our body. Of course, everyone is familiar with the mental disorder, most commonly referred to as cyberpsychosis, but it doesn't end there. Although advances in medical science, the greater part of the century, have reduced its incidence to a minimum, cyberware rejection can still occur. That sounds terrifying. Like, what if you put something in your brain and just did not... Cyberpsychosis?
Sounds like a bad time. Unity? What is that? I don't know, but we're gonna check it out. On your toes. More bodies ain't coming. They're almost on you. Please fuck these reapers. Hey, that's the corporal cut. Need to find a single buyer for her. Does that mean we just can distract them? So we can get by him? Hold up, we got a we got a uh, piece of armor. Oh, nice. What does that do? Plenty of pockets. It doesn't do anything. It's just for the look. This thing's like a freaking magnum. Clean it up. Clean it out. Don't want to be bringing the target out of the car. And definitely don't want to slug in your back. That all you got? No way. Not enough. We got this thing. We didn't have this thing. God damn. Good. Good. Stuck on a freaking grenade, man. Okay, so tech stuff is going to be really good. You can do overheat and it does like damage to them over time. Rip up the shred! Shit, there's more people? What does this do? Reboot optics? Room he's in looks out on the balcony. Got a window on the left. Give me two seconds to oh. the lock. Mano, get his attention. Now, nah, we're good. Don't see any Cle movement on the Clean sensor. headshots. Like you got him. You're clear to go. Shit, where the hell's our target? Oh, damn. Look around. Gotta be there somewhere. I did not mean that. That was the grenade. He got blown to pieces. Uh oh. You get some money? Damn. This thing is nuts. We got our actual pistol though. There's no ammo. That's kind of nice. It's just stamina. Like stamina based. Oh no, it is ammo based. Huh. It's weird that it doesn't show you your ammo though. Well, that's just for distracting. This guy got loot on? A freaking shotgun. Pain so. What is that? Is that what I picked up? I thought I picked up a shotgun. Huh? Well, that would be awful to get hit by. Absolutely terrible. Alright, one more piece of loot. Didn't weave. Is it? Is 
Does it actually matter what you're wearing? Is clothing... I think this is just... Style. For now, maybe? Maybe things... Maybe certain things have... Uh, buffs and stuff that they give you. Through the door? Is that where we gotta go? What's over here? You know we gotta look around. I'm a freaking loot goblin, so... I gotta find it all. See, we're, we would have missed this. What was that? Low tier item components. Pack of cards. Alright, Lou Goblin, calm down. Oh, what is this? More read. More lore. Pain editors and mor mortality rates. Introduction. The implant known widely as the pain editor is cyberware that reduces e or even entirely eliminates pain. That's wild. It has enjoyed unwavering popularity for years among certain circles in Night City, the most devoted and arguably most valuable of which is mercenaries. It's using this test group that Zeta Tech conducted the following research. The pain editor is a neural coprocessor that inhibits the signals that's sent from the nociceptors, the parietal, Lobe of the brain, thus preventing feelings of pain in the user. Some models also reduce symptoms of fatigue. Uh, the beneficial effects caused by the pain editor are in some ways similar to that symptoms of hypothesia, including greater resistance to physical forms of torture and the ability to ignore pain from severe wounds. It like turns you into a, a freaking madman. Berserker. Yeah, what would this guy have? Heavy machine gun? Excuse me? Look at this thing. Look at this thing. Is this just like a, a, a some use type of gun? Yeah, you just throw it on the ground. Huh. Interesting. I'll take some money. Oh, more lore. Some shoes. Dude, we're getting some kicks. Right, let's read this. The day the tower fell. In early August 2023, a single event would change the course of history, although it fell against the bloody back backdrop of the Fourth Corporate War, the global media still fed on the story for weeks. And could you blame them? A group of terrorists detonated a nuclear bomb blowing Arasaka Tower to pieces. The terrorist warning Came too late, not all of the tower employees could be evacuated. The blast itself killed and wounded thousands, while countless others died from radiation sickness. How did the biggest terrorist attack in the 21st century happen? Who was behind the catastrophe? To find the answers, we'll first need to understand the context of that era. The early 2020s was a period of unrest for Night City, and anti-corporate sentiment was at an all-time high. In the epicenter of the city's lawlessness stood the, the Atlantis Club. It was seen as an island of resistance against the powers that be, primarily megacorporations like Militech and Biotechnica. Though a special place in hell was reserved for Arasaka, the Japanese arms manufacturer Zaibatsu that held the most influence over Night City. The kinds of people who frequented the Atlantis 
uh, felt that corporations had hijacked the future and turned people into consumer slaves and ironically deprived of the two things capitalism loved most. Freedom and choice. These people called them themselves edge runners. They positioned themselves against the corporate world order. They declared their own freedom in opposition to the status quo, but deprived of any peaceful way to meaningful change what they called the system. They reached for more radical methods of self-expression. These people are no, no strangers to violence. Man. 2020 sounded like a bad time. Is this outside? Okay, well, we're not supposed to go that way. Wait, is that a bunch of loot? Spontaneous craving satisfaction machine. Snack bar. Jesus fucking Christ. What the hell? Shit, V. I mean, I got a stomach of steel, but this, ah, oh, this, I wasn't made for this shit, you know. Chop shops, what they do to people, fucking scab psychos. No more jobs like this. Por mi madre. Think I got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, Barely if she is. You know what we're dealing with. Oh, this does not look good. She's in the tub of ice, crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slabs of meat. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. Her people who live through shit like this get panic attacks. That ever known why? You'd be sipping a glass of ice cold water and suddenly your hands shaking. V, Jack, Jesus. enter her biomon. We need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. That's messed up. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Jesus. Good idea. Check her neuroport. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Is that even safe? Can't we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that biomon working, checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. Found the shard. We're moving now. Check the biomon. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Damn. Biomon claims Trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Only 90%. Let's get her off that ice. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, hermano. Do your thing. Fudge. Ah, oh, fuck. She's flatlining. V, need to know what's going on. Jackie, air hypo. Fuck, this is bad. Hey, catch, Vato! I think. Holy shit, it worked. Where a cabron? Get her outside. Oh my get god. Her Terrace. Sorry.
I'm sorry. Place the patient on the ground. Five steps back. Now. Jeez, man, I'm helping. I'm helping. T-133 to control. Patient NC-570442 secured. Stimulants being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for Brinogen. Man, if only health insurance was that good. Let's get out of here. Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Good work. Shit show's over. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. Listen, Mano. I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? That was messed up. Hmm. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's I gonna look for me? Won't leave you hanging, Jack. Don't get used to it. <laughs> Saving my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. Okay, so that's how we have to get. Nice. That's how we call people. Good stuff. V, how did it go? Our client is alive and well. Yep. So far. Relatively speaking. Relatively well. Trauma team took her off our hands. She'll recover. Maybe. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you are to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is going to put Watson on lockdown. If I'm going to sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Aw, oh, damn. I'm driving. Let's go, Jackie. Put that thing in the in the fifth. That'll do the middle. Jackie, they're locking down Watson, remember? <laughs> oh, shit. You're right. Is it just me or... You better go, man. You know it. Oh, what the shit? Man. Fucking drive, Jackie. Screw these guys, man. Can't keep her steady. Oh, 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 baby. Headshot. Holy fuck! Mierda, perdón! Let me take that shot, man. Got you, assholes! B, aim for the driver! Chingalo! Get out of here. <sighs> Scratched your baby up pretty bad. Sorry, V. It's okay. It can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. They just got people like popping out of nowhere to take your shit. That's. Yeah. 
got bars like I'm naughty, got bars like they caught him with cars like they knocked it today. I'ma crash it tomorrow, I'm copping. I stay with the leaders, leaders, sipping with my leaders, leaders. All of y'all be tripping, I be tripping with a diva. I'm gonna ride it, they calling me. I vote like go with a dollar be. Nothing and nobody stopping me. One more year, I get what I want. No damn. They already have it. They already have it shut down. We got freaking mechs out here. What is the lockdown to further notice? Necessary security measure. Officer, ma'am. Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you? Really? What's it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold. Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. Oh I mean, man. I'm trying to be a stand up guy. Is she giving me a chance? Waiting. Mm, that's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe. But he's a good kid. Silver tongue. But they're the last. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. <laughs> Hell yeah. Silver tongue. She took a liking to you. The devotion I demonstrated grabbed him by the gun. <laughs> right. I'm loyal, stable in my affections. Mm -hmm. And unassuming. You get it. Oh, Jackie. Jesus. Jesus. Gunks out there, though. Just a midday snack for him. Well, show's over. Poor bastards. Time's running out. They had it coming. The music never stops. One of one point nine. The dirge. Oh, nice. So you can just skip it if you want. you not likely to make it back to Haywood now kill V don't let me through sure about that oh yeah I'll play nice Jackie again <laughs> I said hi. I will. I you know, win. the music that's like non DMCA is not not that bad. They do a good job just making stuff for the game. We level. How do we do that? Character? Uh huh. We get one attribute point, one perk point. Well, we're gonna. We're going to go into reflexes, but then we have, we have one perk point we can go into. So this is, this, I'm guessing that's the only point we can put in. Otherwise you get this, unlock supreme, new ways to exit vehicles, jump out, slide out. You can also draw and fire weapons during these stunts. And then there's slippery. The faster you move, the more difficult you are for your enemies to shoot you. Effect increases when dashing, dodging, sliding, sprinting, or bolting. Huh. 
Well, I think we have to take that before we can go up further. Precise thermal paste. <laughs> Some of those ads are funny. You don't have to be rich to sparkle. Health warning. Alcohol drinking may result in potentially dangerous behavior. Yeah, yep. Oh. Sometimes you make bad choices. Been there, done that. Who hasn't? How's it going? We get some sodas? Oh, burritos! They have vending machines that just give you burritos? Sounds like a dream. It sounds like a dream! You just scan people? You can. That's kinda cool. This is my room. This is my this is my humble abode. New release brain dances. What's up BD maniacs? Hungry for a new emo rush? And check out the latest word from the freshest BDs on the market. I don't know if I can. We're gonna take this vodka though. Dude, look at that. Is that. Oh, it's a little. Is that a plushie? We have a little plushie. That's kind of cute. Body needs some tweaks. Approach the mirror in your apartment and or safe house and select the change appearance option. Got some favorite threads. Create outfits in your apartment wardrobe so you can change the appearance of your equipped clothing whenever you want. We can just change the way we look. Whenever. Okay, well, I mean, we were pretty gross. We did have a lady in our arms that was uh, mutilated. Probably needed. Probably needed a shower. Oh, damn. This is the stash room? Your stash is a secure system for storing equipment and can be accessed from all of your available safe houses and vehicles. I wanted to finish reading that. Rude. Yo, what? Do they give us this stuff? Yeah. Man. So this stuff is from. I'm get. Well, some of it might just be, so you can have different weapons. Um, you know what I mean? Let's 
take the submachine gun? Because we're not going to use pistols. We're going to use... I think it's assault rifle and submachine gun. If I'm not mistaken. Bees stained tank top. Streetwear pants. Street kicks. But like this is from something that we've done. Like outside of this. This is from having the Witcher. All that stuff. I don't know if it's it makes you better. I think it's just for style. But these weapons are kind of broken. I feel like. So we're not going to use those. But let's throw on these. We have an attachment for this. Oh. Additional zoom. All right. We make our we style ourselves. You got anything cool in here? Wardrobe. You can have up to six outfits saved in your wardrobe. These can be activated or deactivated in the outfit section of your inventory at any time. Activating a wardrobe outfit will change the appearance of your clothing. You have equipped, but not change the stats. All clothing you find, receive, craft, disassemble, disassemble, buy or sell will be saved in your wardrobe's memory. Oh, that's cool. So it's just like cosmetic. And it's everything that you have. Or have ever picked up. I think that's kind of cool. Damn, look at those pants. Oh, you know we gotta rock some chucks. Alright, that's kinda cool. I'm, I'm assuming we'll just keep getting gear. So that's, that's sweet. Let's go to bed. I like that. It just lets you look cosmetically good. Hello, Night Oh, V. You get any sleep? No matter. Time you got up. I think I might have caught something when I jacked into that corpo's biomon. Dunno, uh, uh -oh. neurovirus, sir. Need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. Dude, that'd be terrifying ride. too. Throw some threads, meet me downstairs. You give freaking computer viruses? Oh, that would be absolutely terrifying. Did I just use this? Um, I'm going to take the clothing out. Just so we can have it in our stash. Or like this. So we can have it in our wardrobe, I guess, is what I mean. Dang, look at that. We're spiffy. I kind of like that. That looks cool. Or we can have our our Witcher jacket. Yeah, we still rock the chip, the chucks. I don't know. I feel like, uh, let's rock that and we'll take this off. 
Why, why wouldn't let me take that off? Unequip. But it's still wearing it. Suspicious. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. Alright, me with Jackie. Check your email. Hey V, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? Is that a cop? I don't even know my name. I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. Where's my email? Here? Is it in my stash? Messages. Of course. Scam. Vehicles buying on the auto fixer net page. You'll find all vehicles currently up for sale. You can access this net page from your computer in the apartment from the or from other computers throughout Night City marked with a car icon. A vehicle's picture may display an icon to indicate that it comes equipped with a built-in weapon for a machine gun or a missile launcher. As your street cred grows, so will the number of vehicles available to you on Auto Picture. You've been attacked. Warning! Malware detected. Your computer has been attacked by three demons. Our system detected. Two attempts to obtain your personal data. Interesting. Do not click on any emails with ads for penis enlargement. Well, what a surprise. It's just like a normal email. Pointless. Alright, how do we go back? There we go. Waste of time. Checking your email, worthless, just like in real life. MCPD, open up! Whoa. We got a call! We're here to help! We know you're in there! Alright. Ignore the police. Just, just leave them alone. It says up here, rent paid. Damn. Thanks for the stretch, baby. Okay, can we get a burrito? Can we get the burrito XXL? The burrito XXL? Or the burrito? Thanks for gifting us though. I appreciate that. Nice. Had to get a burrito. Okay, where are we going? Out the door here? Not out the door there. Am I going crazy? Did I go the wrong way? This way, okay. Shit, come on! It's a rush. Two. What do you say? Coach Fred. I like my new punching bag. 
Just gave me a next-gen ass whooping he did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of V. <laughs> so how about it? Sure. Let's do this. Let's throw down. Right on your feet. Keep that head moving. Fist fights. Your fists can be dangerous weapons. In fist fights, you can use them to both strike your enemies and block their attacks. That was easy. I can arrange a fight or two. What do you say? You mentioned something about fighting. Mm. Hey, if I've we can make some money. Blows in the ring. If we can make some money. Sharp instinct, good edge. You know what I mean? We can go far. Especially if, if we can make some money. These fights. Let's just say they aren't leap. But very lucrative. Yeah, lucrative for who? You or me? Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings. You know, as your agent. You get the rest. Sounds fair. You want to get rich off my hard work? Oh, I get it. You want to get rich off my blood, sweat, and tears. Hey, you got to make a buck somehow, right? At least I'm giving it to you straight. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. When you take home the pot, manage to drop every last Easy one enough. of them, you get a chance to fight the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. You can start in Kaboom. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of. Okay. I mean, that's cool. Find the ring in Kabuki. Do we want to do this for a little bit and get some money? Collect your gun from Wilson. Let's have a look. Oh, they hook us up with a gun? Dying night. Yeah, you do need ammo. Oh, we have a ton. There's 688, 840, 699. I feel like it's not that hard to keep ammo. Handyman. Oh, it's a scope. You just acquired an iconic weapon. Iconic weapons possess unique abilities, however, they cannot be improved with weapon mods. With the appropriate components, iconic weapons can be upgraded to a higher tier, which significantly improves their power. You can do this from the upgrade tabs of the crafting menu. Iconic weapons can be found all over Night City. You might receive one from a friend or loot one off an enemy. It's also possible to find some simply lying in the ground or available for purchase at vendors. Some you might even craft yourself. Thanks a lot. Okay. Can we take it into the range? I don't think so. <clears throat> That's our submachine gun. And kind of cool looking. I like that. I like that. Okay. Head down to Jackie. Sweet!
The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. And in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at all right. we wish you a safe Oh, so this means they're rocking cybernetics? Patrol officer. It's all in the report. Oh, I read it. Except there's no mention of me telling you to delta the fuck out of there. Yeah, no biggie. All right, I'm sorry. That the, cyber uh, psycho was a tank stay away from them. NP or NCPD scanner hustles. NCPD will help you or will pay you to help fight crime. Gigs fixers will contact you when you approach the gigs location. Fixers, these immediate. Intermediaries will inform you about local gigs available. Oh, you can just sell anywhere? That's kind of nifty. Junk. That's all junk. Okay, so you can just get rid of junk for money. Good to know. Oh, what's up, Jackie? Mm. Man of the hour. You got cup noodle? Sheesh. Took you long enough. Worked up an appetite just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Didn't figure you was a type for Asian. Would have thought you'd find it too exotic. What do you mean? What's there not to like? <laughs> Noodles? Check. Since sirloin? Check. Get some more chile action up in here and you're looking at Mama Well's signature sopa de fideos. <laughs> Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. <laughs> 300 pounds of partly gold plated cool. Dex ain't out of the picture. Dex bounced out of the ring a few years ago. Messed with the nasty crew in Pacifica. Things got ugly. Mm-hmm. Gang wars two years back. Somehow Dex got caught up in the craziness. A lot of bodies lying in the streets by the time the shooting stopped. Yeah, Dex got lucky though. Managed to slip under the radar till tempers cooled. Took a while. But he's made one hell of a comeback. This is the Jackie, our big break. Eyes up to his elbows in blood, Jack. You want to shake his hand? Work with him? It's the biz, V. Everyone's got blood on their hands. You deal with it. You move on. How'd you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You know me? Oh, but t -Buck, she's the one that hooked us up. Got us oh. talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on, ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. What's the job? What's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal is right on you now, I say. Why me? Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Oh, Dex says he needs to check you, talk to you. Huh. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but 
Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? Not really. Not really. No. <laughs> it's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half-baked shit pie their client put on the table. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias, your wheels. Get Let's go. Guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. You can call your active vehicle near your current location with V. Okay. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. Call vehicle. Oh, it's already here. Damn! That looks way better than it did. First stop. Look at that little Easy dog. Gas, huh? I just ate. Accelerate with W. This is gonna be weird. Driving with keys. Stop by Vicks anyhow. It's gonna be a little weird. Oh damn! Drawing your weapon while driving enables combat. Allowing you to drive and shoot at the same time. You can use pistol submachine guns while sitting behind the wheel. By default, your aim will lock on enemies automatically. This setting can be changed with the settings menu. Okay. How do I, uh... Really gets me, you know. One keybind I want to know. That's bothering me. I think you can go back out while you're in the, uh, like you can zoom out to the car. I think. Cycle camera Q. Yeah, that's way easier to drive. But yeah, driving with the um, with keyboard is gonna be kind of weird until we get used to it. Get out of the way. Yeah, we did it. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. Are they running away because my gun's out? <laughs> Is that Co? Oh no, it's Gary the Prophet. Let's just say you're right. So what? Should I just gouge out my optics? Thanks, but no <laughs> thanks. You are beyond salvation, but not the children of the future. Life untainted by surgery of the sacrilege. We can yet save them. May the mothers shield their bodies. May the fathers instill their hatred for Crow. But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Why the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri? In their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed masses by putting our laughter, oh. our tears, on full display. Crazy guy, like in that show. Wait, get next to him. I'll snap still if you arresting him for revealing government secrets. Open your mind before it is too late. Oh, they taking pictures. They taking pictures of Go. will like die when she sees this. Like, this is Max Nova. I just can't. Alright, Co. Nice to meet you. 
You have a good one. I mean Gary. Sorry, Gary. Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. All right. Uh, you look pleased? I'll go in. Because I am. Goodbye. Always. Is that a kitty cat? Hi, little kitty cat. Is there something you want, loser? Yeah, the cat. Radio this is what I care about. Of the machine. Not you. I'm gonna pet it again. What a good kitty. What is that? Is that a quest? Oh no, it's a car. It's my car. River Dock. Though a common practice, cyberware installation is still dangerous and invasive procedure, which can only be performed by qualified specialists, Ripper Docks. There are several Ripper Docks operating throughout Night City who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Select your desired cybernetic upgrade from a list and enjoy your new abilities. Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Whole kit and caboodle. All right, Kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Heard of Dexter, Dexter Met Deshaun? A new fixer. He gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshaun. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. All right. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dex to Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something, but... Let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Hey, you want the jobs done? I don't have 21,000, so, uh... <laughs> Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the eddies later. With interest. You know I will. I, uh, don't have that much money. That's Last a lot. Time. That's a lot. You hear? Chair, please. Sit down. Relax. What's he gonna do to me? Besides, get rid of the the virus that's in my system. Kuroshi Optics, best I've got, and should be about oh. right under the circumstances. New eyeballs. Now check in. Kuroshi, that's top shelf. Kuroshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. Oh, he's a businessman. No, don't worry, we can just you put you in debt. And choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. You're fine. Credit. Basic Kuroshi optics, plus two health. Minus 20% camera detection speed. Four times the optical zoom when scanning. Huh. Cyberware capacity indicates the amount of cyberware your body can handle. The limit increases as you level up. Acquire certain perks to use and use uh, cyberware capacity shards. 
Looted cyberware. Cyberware you acquire in the world can be installed or sold at any ripper dock. Damn. What are these? Ballistic co-processor. Increased ricochet chance with power weapons. Directly links the user's optical implant to the weapon system, offering real-time info. Reload speed at plus 1.4%. Dang, okay. Makes our fingers move a little quicker. Alright. What is this? We're just putting subdermal armor. Plus two health. Indicates your resistance to damage. You can increase your armor by investing in skeleton and in integumentary system. Cyberware categories. Okay. That didn't give us more armor though, did it? Upgrade to tier one. Oh. Whoa. Quick hack menu? Oh, these are the ones we can use on people. So you can change those. It's kind of like your spells. That's kind of cool. Circulatory system. Oh, you can buy different ones. Skeleton? Oh, we don't even have... We don't have w anywhere near enough. Um... Everywhere stuff. Capacity. Mark 1, like I said. That's Decent cool. Scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Sure you can really, like... Built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. Get down Just to remember, it. remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Mm. There's some cool customization. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Yeah, Let's just pop this. pop them eyeballs in. Give me them new eyeballs. Play that major league arm of yours right here. What's new in the life of Vic? So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? Yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and That's how I live my why. life. And what happened? One day I just dropped it and just hang out. Back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Exactly. Just like that. He's not, he's not out there getting murdered. Now, a bit of anesthetic, and I can start cutting. Oh, he's gonna chop up my hands. Put that thing in. Feel anything? Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. <laughs> Lights out for a minute, all right? Oh, and he does the eye. Oh, that's weird. Oh, that's weird. Let me just take your eyes out real quick. Boop. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. Oh, that's weird. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. How weird would that be? Look at your body from the outside. Oh. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Better than ever. Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Scanning people with your optical cyberware can improve or can provide you with a lot of useful information, such as how strong an enemy might be, who's in their crew, and what type of weapon they use. As a skilled netrunner, you can see a lot of quick hacks, uh, which you can use against your enemies. Time for the scanner. Yep. 
It might take you a few seconds to adjust. But first time's rarely the charm, with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. Well. I also injected an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> okay, so it can show us. It can show us people are uh, wanted. A database of individuals with bounties assigned to them is now available to use. You can identify those wanted persons with your scanner. Since all are wanted, dead or alive, the methods you use to claim your reward are entirely up to you. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. Oh. Well, that's nice. Now we can actually see our ammo. Thanks, Big. What about the virus? How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Dude's effective. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stem. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. Damn! Once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. He's cool. He is freaking cool. Pay off your debt to big friend. Hi, little kitty. You know we gotta pet it. Every time we see a cat, that's the new goal. What's taking so long? I'm petting cats. Okay, well we're not we're we're not doing this one. That's for sure. Talk to Jackie. Uh, we have all the DLC stuff too, but we're not doing that because that's way down the road. I feel like I'm gonna really enjoy this. This is gonna be a good game. Watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. Anything in between the Skyrim playthrough, for sure. Thanks, Misty. You're the best. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay. Do my best to talk us up. Was he getting a massage? A little pet Manny Petty that was going on. I like it, Jackie. Take care of yourself. Regina Jones. Listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope well, that's, that's all not fun. <sighs> Incapacitating enemies. There are non or there are various ways to incapacitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal takedowns, non-lethal quick hats, non-lethal weapons. EMP grenades and some combat gadgets. Weapon mods that change damage to non-lethal. If a given weapon, combat gadget, or quick hack deals non-lethal damage, it'll be mentioned in the description. Okay. You can recognize them 
by their cold blue eyes. Creatures born centuries ago on the Antarctic ice. They hide their true faces under masks of human skin. Two-faced snakes, oppressors of humanity! Not the lizard people. Do you think President Myers is one of them? Why so many shootings? Why do countless die on the streets as the police do nothing? What human would condemn his brethren to such suffering? And why? And where did this filth slither out from, you ask? Antarctica, you said that already. Today they hide amidst the snow and ice of the South Pole. Step by step, usurping our crown as creation's chosen. Millions of years ago, they evolved from dinosaurs to become the world's first advanced, intelligent race. You know. And who is their progenitor? Their masters? The scientists of Alpha Centauri! He's a prophet. He knows what he's talking about. I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Oh, wait, hold on. Will you provide a humble donation <laughs> so that I may continue my mission? <laughs> you know what? Go. Go can have work. money. Here you go. This is to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. Oh, man. I saw a disciple of truth in you from the very beginning. He's, sp he's speaking the truth. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen and those with eyes behold. He's speaking the truth. Oh. Netrunner? Hold on. With the cyber hack installed, your scanner provides additional information. Is this guy a bad guy? Huh. I wonder why it's got the skull over the head. Is that one of the people we're supposed to take down for that quest? This? Ever heard of a fixer named Regina Jones? Not exactly in the same league as Dex, but she uh, must have heard about you since she wants you to turn you into a one-man army in the fight against cyberpsychosis. Understandable. Yeah. Find and incapacitate cyber psychos. That must be what that's from. The skull. Okay. So the ride is over there. Painful side job. Man, let's how big is this map? Not what I wanted. Okay, this is it. There's got to be more to it than this. This has just got to be the beginning. Okay, this way, right? Me with Dax. Yep. Somebody is shooting. What is happening? Gang war? Racketeer. Are we supposed to take these people down? I have no idea, but we're doing it. Performing certain actions will reward you a street cred. Build your street cred to make a name for yourself in Night City Underworld. Am I getting shot in the back? By the police? I'm making an enemy of everyone, I guess. Go 
I did not mean to get up there. Oh god. Why am I in a, in a war with the police? I didn't even mean to shoot them. Oh, I'm out of potions. Hey, we did it though. What the? Oh, I'm wanted now. I see. Kind of like GTA. Well, now that we know, don't shoot the police. I guess that should have been known. <laughs> I didn't even mean to. I was trying to take down the uh, the other gang. Okay, the gang. Do my best to talk us up. Well, I guess now we know. What are you? This delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I, know I wonder if we can take these guys out without shooting the police. Sorry, really gotta go. I'll call you back. Oh. Okay. So they just got mad at me because I shot the other guys. Yo, can we hack this by getting in here? Nice. Yo, Mr. V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample and deep. The music didn't shut up. Or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like hoses without seeing your 30. Hold on. Just so we can hear what's going on. I think with the music bugged because we were in the middle of combat. Whoopsies. Just so we can hear what's going on. Okay, we're gonna read this, uh, since we missed it. Would you rather live in peace as a- Uh, Mr. V? As a Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory? How they remember you? That's all that counts. It's first place and no place, Dex. Cost Hell yeah. Is the factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Why meet me? Why the show? Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Buck sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and Sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Guess that makes sense. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Pre-mission? The job, tell me more. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Sounds like it might be. That's a death sentence. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. B? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. 
Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow, cause we gonna do this clean and on the hush-hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Maelstrom, what's the issue? Client, tell me about her. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What do you mean? He's a smooth talker. Maelstrom, what's the issue? What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Guy's gonna give me a virus, man. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. All right. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Dude, these guys look nuts. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. Their cybernetics are crazy. As the Shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce guy, who is he? Royce guy, what's he like? A straight psychopath, chrome loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that, except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. <laughs> Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. This city is messed up. Who's the woman? Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. They're like insults are just primo. So good. Now all I need, think. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. We already said blaze of glory. We go out and fire. Okay, we can turn the, the music back up now. It just uh, messed up when we got into the car. Alright, perform certain actions will reward you a street cred. Build your street cred to get a name for yourself in Night City. Doing so will open up new opportunities. We're in the Kabuki area now. What happened to my gear? There we go. Um, let's see. Oh, we have we have a freaking two points to put in. Hell yeah! I think getting reflexes up is gonna be good because I think we're gonna go assault rifles. 
in the tech. Probably pretty good too. Whoops. One. Go put uh, another one into tech. Cool. Oh, once you get to nine, you get into the next one. I see. And then this requires 20. Man, maybe, maybe we should have put that in there. That's okay, though. We don't have any... Oh, we have still have perk points. Oh, no. What does this do? Increases slide distance. Increased vaulting and climbing speed. Allows you to reload weapons, weapons while sprinting, sliding, vaulting. That's pretty good. Allows you to shoot while sliding and sprinting. Hmm. I feel like reloading while moving is going to be pretty good. What's our uh, tech stuff that we can get? 5% instant recharge of health items and grenades. That's going to be really good. Yeah, tech's going to be good. Right, so then what? Hang on, gotta go. Oh, uh, sorry. We, cu we cut her off two times now. Okay, I'm back. Talk. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tag hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Yo. Yep. It's clear. Okay, we're supposed to call Jackie. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally at nine, yeah? Wants to check us out, see if we got what it takes. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Alright. <laughs> uh, know anything about Royce? You don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack, something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. That's what once his name said. And there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I think we go the maelstrom get the thing i say we knock on maelstrom's door first pound actually yeah get the get the little uh, robot thing in that case i'll hit the all foods put my nose to the ground sniff around I still know to go. me with jackie all right how far away is that not too bad we could probably hoof that Oh man, there's just a bunch of, are these all psycho guys? Or they're just, they're just net runners. Oh damn. Dexter to shop. How about, oh maybe we should get in our car. <laughs> we gotta go across the highway. Uh, how about a little something to get those the taste buds tingling? The biochip in question is in fact the so-called relic, a Nova tier piece of tech, catering to the top one percent, supposedly the best life insurance money can buy. 
You're not going to be neck deep in money. Where's my car? Oh, it's right there. Kind of fancy that it can just come right to you. It's like Batman. We are going to have to get used to keyboard driving. I wonder if I should use the, the, my PS5 controller for this game. I wonder how that would feel. Ah, there you are. Let me hear what you squared away. Which one is get out? I don't remember. <laughs> We've only been in the car once. Exit vehicle app. All right, there we go. We'll we'll remember the buttons. It'll just take a second. What's the word on T bug? T bug show any sign of life? You two talk. She's up to date and fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. They're familiar, you know? Worked together before Dex took his break. Oh, get over it. Go around. Been waiting long. Mi madre always said patience pays off, so... I'll move my car. Yeah, go around. It's fine. It made me get out. So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? Uh uh. Doubt this will go smoothly. That shit can go smoothly. We don't got ten thousand money. We don't got ten thousand. Complicated. Might's right. The strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. <laughs> so, into the Borg beast Valid. then. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go see these bastards. All right. Let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. I want to look at what, um... What does this give? Assault rifle still machine guns. Yeah, so we're good. And then blades. So we're going to have to get... I guess we have that katana, but... I, I don't really want to use it. Fuckers. It's had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I think the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor me. Uh, later then. Uh, later then. Oh, okay. I thought it was something we could loot. Sorry, Jackie, I'm sorry. I'm coming. Go. Okay, the loot goblin in me I had to look around. Let's try this SMG. Just open the fuck up. Just open the fucking door. Yeah, you make a fucking appointment? Cause I don't see nothing in my book. Dex sent us. Wanna to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Oh damn. I guess that. That could have went for. Cozy place. Could use a few plants though. That could have went poor. Oh yeah. 
They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in the Chow factory. Yeah, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. Yeah, they're cray crays. Do you see their faces? They have like half their face and it's all robotic. This. Yo, we got a new jacket? New jacket? Okay, that's kind of cool looking. You'll attack mine. Anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. Damn. My favorite. Subtle. They got mines everywhere. This could get wild. Excuse me? Excuse me? This is gonna go bad. This is gonna go poorly for them. That's what this is gonna. So what do you want? Now look at this guy. Here to see Royce. We got biz to transact. Get out of my way. Mr. Royce is busy just now. His name's Dum Dum. Here for the planet. You got a bot. Model MT0 D12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Yeah, get out of my nah, damn way. You talk to me. Name's Dum Dum. Now couch. Planet. Okay, Dum Dum. Jack, you called it. Let's scrap the bastards. Yeah, screw that shit. I don't got time for these guys. Fine. Gotta be around here somewhere. Liberty? You can control the trajectory of bullets that ricochet. Whoa, whoa. Ricochet bullets? Is that what that was? I want to look at that. It doesn't say it on there, though. Wilson's Lexington gives you the additional hope of seeing yet another Night City Sunrise. Increases damage while moving and guarantees shock. Okay. That's a pretty good pistol, but we're not doing pistols, so... You know. You know. It is what it is. I like the submachine gun. Might as well take these guns, though. We can... Scrap them, sell them, do whatever we you know. You find anything? Nothing yet. This door? The 
flathead. Model MT0 D12. Militech logo. Let's see this bad boy. Okay, so we okay. found it. Damn. Tier 3. M10 AF Lexington. Weapon Mon. Power Assault Rifle. What else does this guy have in here? A taco? Dude. Nice. Alright, what is this weapon? Power Assault Rifle. And then we have the Copperhead. 8.8. .8. Weapon Handling. Damage. It's more damage than the other one. This one has more damage, but it's a power weapon. We'll see. We'll see how it handles. Is this like a... Oh, it's a three-round burst. I like that. I like three rambers. Oh, hey, little guy. Love tinkering with new gear. Tech poetry. Great piece of chrome. Feels like fucking Christmas morning. <laughs> Thing looks sick. Gotta find a way out of here. Got the set, bot and controller. Then let's go. Oh, level up. Hold on. Quicker the better. Hold on. We want to pump one into here. Boom. Now we can dash. Stamina cost is reduced by 20% for dodging and dashing. Press V to dash. Lead and steel. I think we want this. For shooting with assault. Yeah. Reload speed. That's gonna be good. That's gonna be good. Well, let's get out of here. I'm dying for some fresh air. I'm the ladder. Let's go, Jackie. line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Who's this? Really no other way. Taco? What's this? I couldn't believe my eyes for a moment. I thought Jessica had changed them out for faulty ki Kiroshis. While I was asleep, but no. Oh, is this just like a... A book? A diary? We're reading somebody's diary? Come on, get up there. Nice. Medical forceps, medical gauze. It's just junk, I think. Where the hell? Oh, don't climb. Disinfectant. Okay, yeah, this, this is where it's gonna get real. Oh, that's a, a body dump. Okay. Turn off. It's a long hack. Okay. 
Oh, did we piss somebody off? Uh-oh. So we can do this stealthy. I shut the camera off. Ah, here we go. We can shut this one off. Nice. Okay. Can we get him to come up here? There's no nothing to distract up here? Damn. I was hoping I could get him to come up here. That guy, he's gonna die. Nice. Oh, I don't like that. Weapon glitch. Calm down, Jackie. Stuck on grenades. I can't disarm it. Oh, it's a brick. I can't disarm it. So you're a brick, yeah? I'm brick. Royce did this. The beast, fuck. I don't have the I don't have the tech for that. Sorry, man. I wish I could help. Wish I could help. What is this? Oh, this is stuff we can upgrade more? Street cred? Is that what that does? Oh man, headhunter. Oh, this is for getting these abilities. Oh, uh, you gain XP. Neutralize the enemies with pistols, revolvers, sniper rifles, throwable weapons, attacking enemies while undetected performing takedowns. Weird, because I'm using, maybe that's with grenades. Interesting. Netrunner, neutralize the enemies with smart weapons. And mono wire cyberware, quick hacking enemies, devices, and vehicles. Okay, that's pretty nice. We do that. That's like uh, um, overrunning them or whatever, overriding them. The burn thing. Shinobi. Oh, we're going to get a lot of this. Neutralizing enemies with assault rifles, SMGs, or blades. Performing certain movements, dashing. But okay, so that's just using the stuff we use all the time. 
Solo, neutralizing enemies with shotgun LMGs, HMGs, and blunt weapons. Hitting enemies with special blunt weapon attacks, performing body attribute checks. An engineer. This is with grenades, so we're going to get a bunch of that too. That's cool. Um... Once you get to level 5, you get that? Okay. That's cool. Oh, and you can reset. That's good to know. Tracing my location? How about you don't do that, you jerk? Screw that. Freaking throwing grenades, man. Jackie, get up! Did Jackie die? He was laying there pretty dead. Oh my god. How many of them are there? God damn. Pull that bad thing up. I'm good. We're good. Intruder detected. Damn, dude. Can you stop? This is nuts. Is there anything else to loot? All foods, the future of meat. Not only are food, all foods products healthier and nutritious, they will feed our future. Soon, all foods will launch a pilot line of new products to complement the Easy Beef brand. It's hilarious. Hilarious that that's in here. Damn. Okay, so your RAM recovers. That's good to know. Okay, where are we going? This way?
Homo Deus, Christianity, and Cyber Modification. So God created man in his own image, in the image of God, so says the book of Genesis. Religious proponents of cybernetic body modifications believe the Christian God intended the same perfection for man as he himself possesses. Suffering, disease, death, these exist in contradiction with divinity, but can be overcome with the aid of science and technology. So-called cyber theologists interpret God's command to subdue the earth, quite literally. By their account, any and all means that might enable man to reach a state closer to divinity are good. I'm not going to put my two cents into that. That's just... Okay. Through the door. Can we get out now? That was nuts. That was one hell of a firefight. Fine. Oh god, do I actually have to have a dumpster to put this body in? Why can't I just drop it? Vines. How do I drop a body? Oh no. Am I stuck holding this thing? Drop. Q. Okay. I was like, I better, not, I better not be stuck with this guy. We got it. We got it. No Life 3. After 50 long years, the wait is finally over. The third and final installment of the No Life series will be available for purchase tomorrow. Some weird lore that they just stick in this game. No, you don't. don't. Oh, damn. I'm weapon glitched. Frickin' overheat, man. Get set on fire. Hell yeah. Oh god. I did not mean to do that. Oh, 
Oh god. It's nice that you can just reload grenades. It's super handy. Let me just play that arcade game in the middle of the firefight. A rosary? Oh, nice. Is this extra loot? Lottery scratch card. We're almost down, I think. We're moving. There's no leak. Gotta cook your core. Shut your trap. I'm ready. Let me at him. Sit tight. I'm in for ya. No leak. No trap. No trap. Ah. Ah. Jesus. This guy's huge, man. Oh, God. Tell him, man, thanks for the sub. I appreciate that. What the shit now? Come on, again! Oh my god. Shame to smash a pretty face. Start saving for a new head. You will find I wanted to see if I could blow something on his back is what it looks like. I'm trying. Holy crap. There we go, we're getting some headshots. Not bad. Not bad. 
Yeah, we're fine. We're good. We're good. Almost. Yeah, we're getting there. Oh my god. Shame to smash your pretty face. Turn you to center. There we go. Holy crap. What a fight. We are playing on hard. So. Man. Tech weapons allow you to charge up powerful shots that can pierce light cover to hit enemies. That's kind of cool. That was nuts. What a fight. I missing anything? You know we gotta loot. That thing was called a VV sector. All right, let's get out of here. That was crazy. What a fight! What a frickin' boss. I feel like that should have went faster if we were hitting him in the back more, but I couldn't get to him. No begging, no debt, no corporal strings attached, and the flathead's ours. <laughs> yeah? That's the way to do biz, V. Tough to argue. Yeah, because I'm right. Always. Nice of you to <laughs> notice. We couldn't get breakout, and that sucks. Ah, I love this town. A city of endless opportunity and brotherly hate. But if you got the cojones and you know how to use them, Chill out. you can do damn near anything. Unless you catch a boat, stray or not. Even then, you go out with a bang, right? And the street'll talk, the street'll remember. What now, Jack? What now? Now I go back. Find Misty. Do something to make me feel alive again. They could have shot us up good back there. No two ways about it. Risks come with the job, Jack. <sighs> Ducked in time to avoid death sweeping sight again. Only right to celebrate. Even though we get to do that lots. Don't forget to let Dex know we got his toy for him. Hell yeah. Talk to Jackie. Call Dex. That is going to do a, or be a good spot for us to finish up for the night. It is a little past 10. We usually only go until 10. <clears throat> but let's hop over here. Thank you so much for hanging out. I hope you have a, had a good time. Cyberpunk's crazy. That game's going to be a good one to play um, in between our Skyrim run. Um... So yeah, I think it's going to be a bit before I'm back. Uh, obviously, we're moving. Um, so this weekend, we will be busy moving. And then uh, I still have to wait for our internet to get set up and stuff. So I think the 7th is going to be two weeks from Wednesday. I think it's a Wednesday night is when I'll be back on the 7th uh, with more Skyrim. And uh, yeah, we'll just pick it up from there. Uh I hope I see everyone in two weeks or a week and a half. Have a good night. Hope you had a good time and I'll see you next time.